actually, I think I went the wrong way there. I think I need to head to the left. Because that was the way that we came. <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. That is what I wanted to do. Now, we can grab the small seed. And nothing else. So let's punch this guy in the face. And my knucks are finally up. Hooray. So now I can switch back to the sword. And I can take on more turtles. <laughs> Damn turtles everywhere. There we go. Oh, how come you didn't die? And we can grab this treasure chest here. With... Hooray. A juggle lump. Very nice. Now I need to head up these stairs here. And through here. I know it doesn't look like you should be able to go through. Oh. Oh, sweet. These guys are weak to the sword. Very nice. Very nice indeed. And this guy is also weak to the sword. I thought those guys were going to be immune to magic for a second there. Or sorry, immune to physical attacks and only weak to magic. But they weren't. But they weren't. So let's continue heading up here. And we can... God, these stones in the middle of the freaking path. We can grab another treasure chest with a wisp icon in it. Now we can head up here. Up to the second floor. Once again, we're just going up and down this freaking complicated temple, aren't we? Stop hitting me with your fire! And if we head over here... We, we can find more enemies. And... Oh. There we go. There's that. I almost missed that. There are a lot of exits here. There are a lot of exits with smoke. Are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? Uh, hold on for one second. Okay, I have my MP that low, so let's just uh, heal that up. And now we can head back over here. I thought this was an exit, but it is not. So let's grab all these treasure chests up here. Chocolate lump, magic walnut, and a honey elixir. Now I don't think I've gone over a honey elixir before. It works pretty much like an ex posing. If you're used to Final Fantasy terms, uh, that will restore all of your HP. None of your MP, but all of your HP. Now we can continue going this way. Slice and dice for the wins. Is this actually an exit? It is not. That's what confused me. I was like, what's down there? Nothing. So let's just head over to the right. And we can take on these guys. <gasps> oh, he's immune. He is immune. Hooray. Go flail. Damn it. I will fuck your face up with my jabbing weapon. What are you hitting over there? Oh, I didn't even see that guy. Here, let me take care of him for you, Misa, because you can't seem to take care of anything by yourself. Is there it? I don't even need anything in this room. Let's just move on, then. Let's just move on. And we've made it back outside, which may or may not be a good thing. We've come across new enemies, it looks like. We have not seen these guys before. They must only come out at night on certain screens. Let's take them on. Stop floating off. And there we go. We can grab this. Get ourselves another treasure chest. And we can get ourselves... Dion Wood! Hooray! Now we need to exit to the left. We're still somehow on the, in the Mana Temple, which doesn't make that much sense to me. Damn it. Stop. Stop what you are doing. Stop. No, what did I just say? Get down here so I can hit you. You're going to have to deal with that for now. I don't feel like helping you. So, let's grab a Dion Wood out of there. And we are pretty much done on this screen, so I should probably come back and help her. Hi You're getting your ass kicked. What the hell? Yeah, go ahead and heal yourself while I kick his ass. I guess she was trying to do damage there. But either way, either way, let's just ignore these guys and head over to the right. And up the, well... There we go. I was about to say, aren't there stairs here? There are on this screen. Oh. You dicks. Okay. Hooray. Let's recover from that. God, these guys, man. These guys. Uh, yes, Misa. And then I need to 
Let's, let's actually heal myself using the Chaco Lump. Why not? Why, when, when else am I going to be using these? There's, there's no other time than now. I think I have said that enough, but, you know, we've passed the point of no return quite a while ago. This is probably the longest, um, longest, I guess you could say, dungeon? I guess this is all one dungeon after the point of no return that I've ever seen. Even though technically it's, it's a couple dungeons. And if we head over here, right, the, the Dime Tower, the Mana Sanctuary, and now the Mana Temple. I, I guess you could say it's three different dungeons, uh, but this is all after the point of no return. Remember, once you go into Dime Tower, that is it. Okay, why did this guy drop the chest? I am confused. A little enraged, but mostly just confused. And spikes for Mithril Silver, once again. What? I guess I could run all the way back to the hothouse for now, but... Oh, there we go, a honey elixir! See, that's something that I can use. That is definitely something I can use. So a honey elixir, dryad icon in this room, and it's time to move on back to the man temple first floor. And this is here, and so that definitely means something. Let me use it. I think it is time. Are you guys ready? It is time to head up here. And it is time to confront Julius. So you beat my dragon. Oh well. In the end, such strength is a mere facade that fools only those in this world. Ahead is sacred territory. No one passes through but Julius the Divine. You? A god? Give me a break! The human heart is weak. Consequently, it seeks the veneer of strength. But Master Julius' heart does not waver. Perhaps you have some lingering doubts about your presence here. Is that what you're... Is what you're doing really right? No doubt about it. We're taking you out, Julius, and that's that. Oh dear, I see. Then, by all means. Bogard! Loki. Behold what is in his heart. Confess your sins! I... I gave my wife to Sanctuary, knowing she'd never return again. Behold, your revered Bogart is such a man! A man who treated his beloved so callously! Woe is me! And who is up next? Lester! Willie! Behold what is in their hearts! Confess your sins! When my sister was taken away by soldiers, along with a feeling of sadness was also a sense of relief that I would be free from her oppressive love. Well, how about that? Under the surface of this kind-hearted minstrel beats a cold-blooded heart. Sis. Wah. Really? Wah? Okay. I... When Mana Village was attacked, I... I abandoned the villagers and our leader. I just ran. This man a warrior, considered a lifelong friend by many, ran the like a coward in the midst of crisis. Ah! You're up, mana girl. Misa! Misa! Loki. At the consul's house when I first met Loki, I envied him. My mother had been killed, but Loki still had both of his parents. I was jealous of his happy home life. That's right. You were coveting Loki's cozy little home and family, and you prayed he'd be in your position. Wah! These are, these are just human emotions, aren't they? Well, how about it? When you look inside the hearts of your companions, it's not a pretty picture. Hmm? What's wrong? You seem to hesitate. <laughs> Bogard. Lester. Willie. Misa. What do you think? 
Having glimpsed the hearts of those you trusted, can you truly say you don't have doubts? Do you remember? When we saw each other for the first time in years at Cascade Cottage, you hauled off be and hit me because you thought I was a realm soldier. An amazing reunion, if you think about it. We've traveled around, met people, and been through so much, and you've become an adult in the process. Inside, I'm still the same kid I always was. Me protecting you? Ha! <laughs> what I wanted was for you to protect me. I tried to play the role of the tough guy for you, but the reality is, you're the strong one. Fool! You cast aside the sword! Loki! With the fate of the world at stake, you toss it away like trash? No, what I've thrown away are my doubts. But you, you've cast aside your heart, and you could never understand. I believe you. I realized something a while ago. Even if Julius took control, I couldn't fight you. Thank you, Nisa. It's because of you that I've come this far. And I'll keep an eye on you from now on, together with my parents and Amanda. Oh, Loki! Mother! Lady Medusa! Devious! Dark Lord! Amanda! All of you, please give me strength! Count Lee! Grons! I understand. Loki, if my power will help you guard Misa, let me oblige. Misa, now is not the time to die. You need to live so you can keep your promise to me. My powers, use them as you see fit. Ms. Misa. I believe in you. My prayers are with you. What? Oh. Insolence! What do you think you're doing? How depressing! Siba, it's about time! Oh, oh, my apologies! You both persevered, Loki and Misa. I'm sorry, Misa. My wife was your mother. Somehow, I knew, Sir Bogard. But you've always been and will always be my beloved Sir Bogard. B Bogard is Misa's... Bogard, you must be relieved. Enough of this superficial posturing! As you demonstrate, we have our weaknesses, but we do not exist on our strengths alone. Sure, everybody's got doubts now and then, but I bet a shadow like you wouldn't know that! We accept each other, warts and all! Imbeciles! Lower life forms! You're the one who has yet to evolve, Julius, or should I say Vandal? How dare you! Just like old times, eh, Vandal? A moment's hesitation lets you slip through my fingers, but I will not let that happen again. Out of my sight, you hypocrite! Master Julius! Shadow, why do you bother me? I'm terribly sorry! Would you grant me magic just this once? As you wish. Have all the nourishment you like. I no longer need it. Lord Grons! Loki, take a good, hard look. Grons. <laughs> what you unwittingly cut was Grons's life. We shadows and monsters all live off his life force to get stronger. Such foolishness. What kinds of friends are you? You shaved off Grons's life without even realizing it. Loki, Misa, make yourself scarce. But... Wait, 